my first day, I remember I had five patients. I started in the med surgery telly floor. One patient I ended up having a seizure. Second patient fell, broke his hip. And the third one actually was getting in a fight with another patient. I'll never forget how challenging it was. But at the end of the day, when those patients were ready to go to home, get discharged, and seeing the smile on their faces and how happy and excited they were to go home back to the families was priceless. My name is Edgar Mendoza. I actually, people know me as Nurse Mendoza. That was, uh, I guess you can say, my alias name. And nursing is my life. My core, I would definitely say just breaking the stereotypical definition of a nurse. When people say, what's a nurse? They think of Florence uh, Nightingale. They think of with a little hat, white dress. They don't think someone who's Hispanic or different culture, ethnicity. I don't think someone with tattoos. There was only four guys in our class out of 30 and it was just us dudes and we stuck together like glue. We did not leave anybody behind. It was just hard to see that because everyone thought we were going to school to become a doctor. Nothing wrong with doctors, just that wasn't my calling. And you're at the bedside as a nurse 24 seven. When you're born, who takes care of you? Nurse. When you're about to go in the ICU, God forbid that happens, the nurse is at the bedside. And that's when I had an idea. Light bulb came on, I said, this is great. You're helping people, you're educating people, you're motivating them, and also you're telling them what to expect. Beautiful. So the trip to the Philippines, we had it all planned for at least three and four months in advance. And it was eye awakening experience. It was a little timid. It was a 16 hour event, we're all outside. A little exhausting, but it was worth it because at the end of the day, what's nursing all about? It's not about a paycheck. It's about giving, helping, and, and, and educating the patients and whoever's there. Because eventually someone's gonna get sick and someone there to help them, that was a huge experience in a third world country. I learned everything from my grandpa, my parents, and that's what formed Crazy Nurse Mendoza. Family's everything. I mean, I grew up all the time together every weekend. It was a barbecue. No birthdays, no Christmas, no Thanksgiving. It was always every weekend we'd have a get together. That was everything, and to this day, they still are everything. All my uncles and my aunts. Three things I learned in life. Change is inevitable, it's gonna happen. If you don't get pushed off the cliff, someone's gonna push you off. You might as well just go off the cliff and take everything that life throws you by the horns. Second, sense of humor is important. Laugh at yourself. Someone makes fun of you, enjoy it, embrace it. We're not perfect, go with the flow of things. But everyone gets you know hurt real easy. Let it go. Third one, most important thing is life's a mystery. Don't ask questions how and why and where. Just go with the flow of things. You're never gonna have all the answers. Three things, embark that, write it down, and remember it. Those are very important in life and in nursing.